think it's so cool. Look at this. Just testing. But you see my locks so long there? Okay, look at this. You see it in this. I'm just waving my hair. The shadow. My body looks kind of like parachute. My body isn't parachuted at all. I'm just thinking about some things. And this is just like raw footage and stuff. But, uh, you know, what exactly is the budget that I need? Like an operating budget to get my stuff up and going. Um, right now, I'm actually going through a situation where the Ontario government actually took the position to racially profile me and um, obstruct um, my livelihood 100%. And uh, I'm not sure why they took this position, but um, there's a person that uh, writes these really dirty letters, and uh, her name is Judy Taggart. And I think he, she should be shot. Uh, she should be actually hanged. Um, what she does is she basically writes these letters to people and uh, she doesn't even like uh, use her brain faculties to say wait a minute here if we're gonna make this decision then what we have to do is we actually have to talk to the person and they never did they made this decision to like I should be driving around blah 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 I should be um, driving up north checking out some of the scenery to see what options are available um, as well as to see uh, you know how I want to live and uh, this bitch she uh, wrote me this letter and she did it twice and um, she basically took this position to say that because of a citation to a medical discourse that is based on European medicine and if you look at like texts such as um, medical apartheid and uh, what they did to black people's bodies um, especially in European medicine and uh, especially white females you know they made this citation to a medical discourse that has actually disrespected our community and our ancestry so I don't even know how to process this spiritually but um, I think also too um, when people when it's time to litigate my position, um, I'm gonna tell them I got stuff. I got my discourse and methodological stuff on uh, YouTube, and um, you know, just uh, take a look at stuff there to see uh, what kind of person I am. And it's just I don't know what I'm noticing in Toronto is that it's a place that uh, it's full of bullshit like car turning, you can dramatize things I'm actually walking into a community here where you see a lot of houses these houses, zero blocks and personally I wouldn't want to live in a house like this because you know what, I love land and space but I love being by the culture and you know, love being by um, you know, a sense of your purpose in life. So, um, just going for my walk.